Let's prove the following. n factorial is greater than or equal to 2 to the power of n for all integers n greater than or equal to 4. Since this is an inequality for natural numbers, we might think of using induction. The base case for induction in this problem is n equals 4. In this case, we have 4 factorial is 24, and 2 to the 4 is 16. So 24 is greater than or equal to 16, which establishes the base case. Now to use induction, let's make the inductive hypothesis, which says that this statement is true for some number k, which is greater than or equal to 4. That is, we're assuming that k factorial is greater than or equal to 2 to the power of k. Then for the inductive step, we want to show that k plus 1 factorial is greater than or equal to 2 to the k plus 1. How do we get here using the inductive hypothesis? Well, we can multiply both sides by k plus 1, which, because k plus 1 is a non-negative number, preserves the inequality. So starting from the assumption, we now know that k plus 1 factorial is greater than or equal to 2 to the power of k times k plus 1. Next, we want to make the bridge between this and what we need to prove. For this, it would be great if we can show that 2 to the power of k times k plus 1 is greater than or equal to 2 to the power of k plus 1. To see if this is true, we observe that both sides have a common factor. So we can factor it out as follows. Now here, we can cancel the factor 2 to the k because it's a positive number, we won't run into trouble with division by 0. So this inequality is equivalent to the inequality k plus 1 is greater than or equal to 2. Now, is this true? We started with the number k at least 4. So the left-hand side is at least 5, which is greater than or equal to 2. So this inequality is true. So from this, it follows that the original equivalent inequality is also true. 2 to the k times k plus 1 is greater than or equal to 2 to the power of k plus 1. Finally, we can combine this with what we already know to get a composite of two inequalities. k plus 1 factorial is greater than or equal to 2 to the power of k times k plus 1, which is in turn greater than or equal to 2 to the power of k plus 1. And from this, we conclude the result we're after k plus 1 factorial is greater than or equal to 2 to the k plus 1.